Hi guys, welcome to my channel, Trying Dutchman. Uh, there's a new dev server live from Unlisted. I'm going to take a f f quick view overview. Um, they did not rebalance any weapons as of now, uh, as in they put it in different tiers. They made a statement they will rebalance weapons. So far, they've kept it all the same as far as I can tell. Correct me if I'm wrong, of course. Um, what they changed is when you can use higher tier stuff, the way it works, or at least as far as I can tell, they changed it. Right now, it uh, gives you a squad over here, and it says you, it tells you what squad you need um, to move up to the, into the ranks, basically. Um, I bought this one from the Battle Pass, and I can use it through this squad. So you can see when you start from the beginning, these use the same, these three, they use the same squad. Yeah, you have the squad logo. It says squad, not over here, not over here. Here it says that again, and with that squad, you can do this one, this one, this one, this one, and that one, which is rank four. So that's quite a lot with one squad. And then mid tier four, not rank four, tier four, you get this one. I had to buy this, even though I already have this in the current game. If you have this one, you also have that one. Um, I had to buy this thing for 15, the squad basically, for 15,000 silver. I don't agree with that. I already had it in the previous game. I already grinded for this thing. Uh, if you do not have 27,000 silver to start the game with, which is not a lot, uh, then you don't even, you cannot even use stuff you already unlocked. So Dark Flow, I think that's not entirely the best way to do it um, because I already had this. I already grinded to get this. I don't want to grind again to get stuff I already had. That's, that's not nice. It's not very ethical. Um, but what this does do is it opens a way to play higher stuff that you might have purchased. So for me now, with the squad from the T-34, I can use the IS-1, which I bought from the Battle Pass. It's fully upgraded. So that's nice. If you go to... Well, first we'll go look at the aircraft, by the way. With the aircraft, they've done roughly the same some planes do need you still have the distinction between a attacker and a fighter um but as you can see here you get this is the attacker squad uh the, sorry the fighter squad of course and then these use the same squad then for this stuff they all use the same uh sorry that's not true this one uses the same one and then this one uses a different one because this is one is fighter and this one is attacker this is also an attacker, I think. It doesn't need a new squad. Yeah, you do need a new squad and for the attacker, yeah. Then you don't need nothing, anything new, nothing new, nothing new. And then at tier 4 again, you need to have something uh, new, new squad. And you can use that all the way up to rank 5. I have a plane from the battle pass. I'm not sure how to unlock it basically i'm afraid i would need to have this one i'm pretty sure actually which means i would have to do grinding at least this one and if i'm with a bit of bad luck even this one which would be good but i'll have to see uh then we go to usa first off the with the tanks this one i don't even see a squad at this but i've also already unlocked it so maybe that's why uh, it doesn't say anything about any of these. This is the first one that has the squad logo, so you can probably just start off with all of those. And here you need a new squad. I think that you need to buy the squad. So what, you're not necessarily buying the vehicle if you already have it, but you need to buy the squad, which is the 15,000 at the tier 4. Um, with this squad, I can use them for this tank and for this tank, which means I already have it basically. And you can go all the way over here to tier 4 and still use that with the tier 2 squad, which is pretty nice if you buy something that's below the jumbo. from And it's not a premium, it's from the battle pass. You can access it as soon as tier 2, which is pretty good. But then to get the higher stuff, I bought this one from the battle pass. To use that, I would have to buy, uh, to use the Jumbo, the Jumbo, which is Normandy level 20 in the current game. Normandy campaign, campaign level 20. Um, 
So this is the same as with the Soviet nation, but it doesn't mean you can get early access. You still have to grind all the way over here. Uh, and then when you're all the way over here, all you do really is skip one thing. You don't have to research and buy this. So this is kind of fucking poop. That means that I spent $12 to save like 12,000, uh, 12 euros to, sp to save 15,000 silver. Which is fucking stupid. Anyway, um, that's this quad. I'll make a screenshot right now. Okay, yeah, guys, I forgot one to mention one thing, which is more of a tip to dog flow and enlisted. Um, if you could make it in a way that I can see over here what squad I need. Uh, let me see what I mean. Not the Daimler. I'm 4A2. Just gonna see if I can find it right here. Unavailable for squad. Yeah. And now it says vehicles unusable by this squad. It would be nice to see what squad do I need? When do I unlock it? What do I need to do to unlock to access this? Because I bought it and now I cannot use it. Um so either give this a custom squad so i can use it like a squadron vehicle on white thunder basically or at least show me what to do to access this because i don't know how I, I i don't know it's not clear so that would be appreciated thank you now for the aircraft uh this one has his own squad same as this one you don't need a new one for this don't need a new one for this don't need a new one for this or yeah that's that's that then for this one you do need a new fighter squad this is tier two new fighter squad and then a new attacker squad at tier three i'm pretty sure i have some version or exactly this one actually um uh, as i bought this from the battle pass for 1200 gold pretty sure it's exactly this one um for that i would need to go up the way all the way up to rank two so if you're someone who bought this like i did or some version of this from the battle pass you only need to get to tier two to unlock that squad so that's very nice um better than the tanks but i already have this one so at least i have a lineup for tier three i would just use what you see over here um then we go on to the next one this is also an a the same squad so is this one then at tier 4 you need a new squadron squad this is fighter part of 2 and with that one you can run the p47 if you bought this yeah that's pretty bad luck or something similar to this because you need to grind all the way rank 5 uh rank 5 rank 1 germany thanks this is all uh the starter squad basically one two three four five six then the seventh tank you need a new squad which is this one 33rd panzer regiment and then this one oh sorry this one uses the same squad same as this same as this same as this it's almost almost identical every tier so far and at tier four you get the panther the panther a then you get a new squad the third panzer regiment and with the third squad you can probably with this squad you can use the tiger but i find this confusing if i can use this one which is after that one that kind of means i have the squad in my opinion proper not but i don't know if i have anything past the panther I should be able to use the tiger because it's this this is the development line here's the squad and everything else is with that squad um and i have that tiger over here in my uh and how do, you, how do you say that in my battle pass list let's put it that way and two i i bought this for 1200 gold as well so i'm not sure i don't really agree it should be the same as with the other ones uh as with soviet i should be able to use this um as for 
Well, okay, so and that's that's the last one you need. So after mid tier four, that's all you need to play end game. If you already bought it like me. Then for Germany aircraft, this one gets a new squad. Same squad, new squad. Wait, I'll show you what the squads are called. Jaske Zweder 52. Same squad. Stutzkampf Zweder 2. Something like that. <laughs> That's a new squad. Uh, same, 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 same. All the way up to end of rank 2. Here you get a new fighter squad. This one. And here you get a new attacker squad. Sextura Gesweda. Interceptor fighter, basically, something like that. And then this one is the same, this one is the same squad. Then this one is the same, and the same, which is tier 4. And then once again, halfway tier 4, you need a new squad for both the attacker and the fighter. And with that, you can go to the end. I bought this one, something similar to this. Well, I'm pretty sure it's exactly this one from the Battle Pass, 1200 gold. And I don't have any of these end things. Which kind of sucks, because that would mean I basically need to grind a hell of a lot to get there, even though I bought it. I, I, I really think that's stupid. If you bought it, you should be able to use it. Just make an exemption for the squad, so create a new squad. That's definitely fixable. And then for the next one... Yeah, that will be a good solution. Uh, like you have squadron vehicles in War Thunder, which is not a premium, but you can buy it anyway. Which is kind of like the Battle Pass stuff over here. And I think that over here, uh, anyone who already bought a uh, a battle pass vehicle should just get a squad when the update comes. So you will check, okay, you have a vehicle, you don't have the squad yet. Just create a new squad, uh, give them super basic uh, looks and stuff, or no weapons whatsoever, doesn't matter. Just give like four or five people so that you're able to use the vehicle you already bought. Maybe even just give them minimum crew, like if you need at least three to operate. Um, and five to have better reload and stuff, then just give them three crew and you have to upgrade it later, something like that. But I really do think that if you you said we will not take anything away, and not only do you charge Silver Lions for stuff that we already literally unlocked, 15,000, which is half of what I got, not only that, you also put stuff that I already bought behind another wall, which I don't think that's correct. You should make it like squadron vehicles, no research boost, but early access to the end. So make a new squad for that one. I think that's a good solution. Thank you very much. And then last but not least, we have Japan, which is for tanks. You get the first squad over here and you use this for that one, that one, that one. This is the first somewhat decent one, in my opinion. Then we get the whole knee, and which is which is less good in my opinion, but whatever. It's a longer barrel, so probably it has better ammunition, uh, better penetration values. But you need a new squad for that as well. And then for tier four, with this one, you can still do this one, which yeah, it's also crappy. Why did they always come with these crappy tanks, man? And then you have this one. This one is pretty good. This is a premium in War Thunder. It's one of my favorite premiums. It's 4.3 BR. It's okay. Reload. A good gun. It's basically a Panzer 3 or 4. I will come back to that in a second. And over here we have aircraft. This one needs a different squad and at the beginning, which is the attacker one. This is the fighter one. Then this one uses the same as one of the previous ones. Healing the new one. I bought this from the Battle Pass for also for 1200 gold, but then I think it's a bit better. Oh, this is five stars. So that will be that's nice that I get access to it this early. I won't have to grind all the way. This is another attacker. You need this squad for it. And then for these are tier 4, this is the fighter and this is the attacker, you also need new squad, so Japan is not very short-cuttable, basically. Um, but then for the tank, 
Yeah, like this is tier four because they do really have still some, have some balancing to do. Oh, this is tier four, and this one has fifty millimeters of armor and a seventy-five millimeter gun. Once again, at tier four. But if you go to Germany, for example, and you go to tier one, Panzer four J is literally tier one. 50 armor and 53 so it has similar slash a little bit better armor than japan at tier 4 and this gun it pans like 109 or 104 millimeters over 100 so this thing at tier 1 can literally penetrate frontally this tier 4 tank and if you shoot where ammo is or you get three of the drivers or two drivers three of the crew members who are in a row uh, then you get an instant kill basically so this, the, the tank part really needs some balancing because you're facing panthers and tigers with this like <laughs> and is1s and is2s like the 85 millimeter gun on the t70 uh, t3476 and the t3485 everything will pan this thing so this is gonna be pain uh no one will voluntarily go use this if you just bought this uh squad this gun is from uh, the premium squad then you're pretty much fucked because yeah, it's, uh, it's gonna be of tier three but still that's that's you have to play a high tier playing tanks at this br will be totally poo poo um well that's it for this uh guys so the silver lions payout should be higher there should be no silver lion wall between or silver lions silver there should be no silver wall behind stuff you already bought uh, and have currently have i already have this but still i just before i recorded i had to pay fifteen thousand silver to unlock something i already have and also stuff that you already bought should be accessible like squadron vehicles and what thunder just created a new squad for them so that anyone who has already bought a vehicle when they log in after the merge you just get a new squad you open the game and it says hi you have new squads uh, a b c d e f g and for each one goes to one of the six things you already bought something like that um it would not cost the developer a lot and it would be satisfying for every player who already bought some stuff and i get pretty a lot of messages <laughs> a lot of people already bought stuff like i did so it's not just me a lot of people did they were like oh nice no, it's gonna be the same as white thunder buy a high tier and skip a lot of garbage uh which is not really the way it works now because they hide it be stuck behind tier four stuff so yeah let us have access to what we bought with some custom squads and that's it thank you very much for watching everyone uh feedback is welcome my last video is almost at a thousand views in one week which is a channel record um it's gonna be one week this evening so i will link it here on the end screen go click it go watch it leave a like that's it thank you very much for watching have an awesome day guys bye bye